Hey guys, how's it going? So today we're going to be doing another GTA Online discussion video. I asked you guys in Discord a few days ago what you want me to talk about, and you guys said you wanted me to talk about the Orbital Cannon spam glitch. Now this is most commonly on the PS4. According to you guys in Discord, that's what you guys said. So apparently, the Orbital Spam glitch lets you orbital spam someone over and over again without even paying for it and without no cooldown on it either now the thing about the orbital spam glitch is that it's been a problem for gta online players since the doomsday heist came out back in december 2017 so around three and a half years and rockstar games still hasn't managed to completely fix the problem i mean rockstar at least rockstar tries to fix it because they patched it but the thing is, when Rockstar patches it, you know someone's just going to find a new one later. So at least Rockstar Games actually tries to patch these glitches. So guys, a few days ago, I also made a video on the Orbital Cannon, doing a discussion if it should be removed from GTA Online or not. And in the comment section of that video, you guys were saying how it should in fact be removed. I kind of agree with you guys on this, because I don't see how the Orbital Cannon has anything to do with the main theme of GTA 5. Because how can how can a cannon in space, an orbital cannon is out in space, how does that have anything to do with the main theme of GTA Online, which is PvP and being a successful criminal? I don't even know what Rockstar was thinking adding the orbital cannon into online in the first place. So guys, a thing that I think Rockstar should do about this is Rockstar should ban players that do the Orbital Cannon spam glitch because they're technically cheating. If you do a money glitch in GTA Online, you get banned for doing that, but how come when you do an Orbital Cannon glitch, nothing will happen to you? Rockstar should make it so if you do an Orbital Cannon glitch, you should get banned for doing that too. If Rockstar does that, that'll prevent people from wanting to do the Orbital Cannon glitch because their account may be banned for doing so. And players will also lose their rank, their money, and their online character. So that'll scare players into not doing the Orbital Cannon glitch and then making GTA Online lobbies peaceful. So guys, another thing Rockstar Games can do to prevent people from doing the Orbital Cannon glitches. If you guys all know in the facility, the Orbital Cannon is in a special room in the facility. So what Rockstar should do is once you use the Orbital Cannon once, it should kick you out of that room and put a lock on the room, where you cannot enter the room again until the cooldown is over. That way, you cannot be able to just spam the Orbital Cannon over and over again. So guys, that's pretty much all I have for this short discussion video. Let me know in the comments what you think Rockstar should change the Orbital Cannon to prevent people from doing the Orbital Spam glitch. And like always, don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos, and I'll see you guys next time.